What's going on guys? So it's been like three months since this whole quarantine started. I was supposed to do an Iron Man that got canceled, then it got postponed. We don't know if it's still gonna happen, but I think it's time that I do an ultra. So tomorrow at 2 a.m., I'm gonna run 32 miles. Let's see how it goes. Let's do it. So I know you may think that an ultra marathon is really difficult, but it's really not that daunting. In fact, I think it's a lot easier than a, a marathon, even though it's a longer distance. So an ultra can range from, you know, 30 miles to 50 miles to 100, but a marathon is 26.6, I'm sorry, 26.2 miles. I'm the math guy. Uh, but the reason why I think that an ultra is not that difficult is because it's a really long run. You're running, yes, you're running for up to, you know, seven to eight hours, but you're running slow, you're taking breaks, you're actually eating more than you would in a marathon. So it's really just the idea of running that long that you have to get over. You have to know that you're gonna be running for a long time, but as long as you're running a comfortable pace, you're with good, good company, you're enjoying the views, then there's nothing to it. The cool thing is that our friend Jamie has the route planned out. I actually don't know where we're running. I know that it's going to be part of Newport Beach and I know that we're running back towards Huntington and stopping somewhere. I believe it's Bolta Chica, but it's going to be really fun because though we are running a lot, of, a group of us are going to be running the 32 miles. There's going to be some friends that are going to join us along the way. So that's going to be exciting. We're going to have food prepped by our cars. We're going to have sodas. We're going to have snacks. We're going to have Hopefully someone will bring music to play along, but it's gonna be fun. Well, obviously I'm filming this before we do the actual run. So all this, these opinions of an ultra can change. So tag along with me, let's have fun. All right, it's two in the morning. I haven't slept. Jamie hasn't slept. We're about to do this 32 miles. We have our Coke, nutrition. Let's do this. All right, we're on mile six. We just had some salt tablets. We got some goo. How many more miles until we see the next group? Uh, uh, 11. 11 miles, 11 miles. We're gonna see Robo, Malaya, and Joe. Exciting. Alright, we got mile 11. We just did a quick stop. We had uh, more water, bathroom break, had some salt tablets. Now we're gonna run three miles to the wedge, which is closer to Balboa, and then back and then meet the crew. Alright, we're on mile 17. We got Malaya, Robo, Joe, some new faces joining us. We're excited. Robo, how do you feel? You're tired? A little sleepy. Yeah? Sleepy. How many beers did you have last night? Three. Three well, beers. Was zero miles in and he's feeling great. Joe was a mile and a half and he's ready to go. Yeah, let's see. Yeah, it's a 17 somewhere in there. There it is. You'll see it. 17 miles. Time to go. Coach Malaya. Yeah. All right, mile 21. Got some coke, 11 miles to go. Jamie's in the back. We got the other crew over there, the morning bandits out in the front. Not bad. I mean, it's all mental at this point, really. You got five more miles till a full marathon, and then six more miles to go. It's not that bad. Whew. It's done, baby. Oh, yeah. So 32 miles, just under six hours. That was really, really fun. Honestly, the Coke works. The Coke works. And here we have our other runners. We got Jamie and Roberto at the finish line. Roberto, what a beast. He, Joe and Milea were crewing us. Look at them. Finishing up, yeah, buddy. Woohoo. Wait, I gotta keep going, I'm not there yet. Let's do it.
Anyway, honestly, if you run these, you're generally pretty slow. You have enough nutrition. You eat right, drink your water, your salt tablets, your goose, and honestly, some Coke at the end to hype you up. It's gonna be a good time.